Hi guys, we're at the antique mall, kind of checking out, see uh, any kind of purses or some jewelry. Uh, I could stay in here actually for hours and hours, but my husband's with me and he wants to rush through here. So I'm going to kind of go through here fast to see what we can find. And at the end of the video, I will do like a little haul of what I got. So let's get to looking. I hate it when he rushes me because I could literally be here for two hours just looking at every little thing. A lot of china, old furniture, antique furniture. Oh, so much beauty. Tell me if you feel the same as far as staying in at an antique mall for hours and hours. Because I feel like if I go through it real fast, I'm, I'm for sure missing something. Gold little handbag, so cute. Love this design here, so cute. Love it. Too pricey for me, but cute. I'm all about a bargain. If that thing was five bucks, it would have been mine. But <laughs> that's dreaming. It's literally so much to see. I'm having to speed through here, otherwise, I wouldn't be going so fast. But any second, I know hubby's going to be around the corner saying, let's go. Cute little Mickey backpack. I did find some purses here in the corner over here. Precious moments. Oh, like I need another one of those. I love precious moments. Found some handbags here on the corner over here. That's a good price for Kipling. Found this Brighton, but it was not in very good condition. I'm having to do a talk over because of the music. They were playing loud. This is a coach purse. Really wish I would have looked at that one there. I don't know how I missed that one with the chain. That looked very interesting. It's funny how you look back on the, on the videos and go, man, what was I thinking? I should have looked at that. Here's the Brighton. The outside was excellent condition. I've never actually seen one like that. But the inside was just all marked up. And who does that? Look at that. Just scribbled all in it. Like the serial number off of it. Just scribbled it up. Little kitty cat. I love kitty cats. Here's the coach. Now the outside a little scuffed up too much for my taste and the inside was all a bunch of ink, ink spots and everything and dirt and everything. I was like, eh, I have to pass on that. 
if they're not that bad, I, I clean them up, no problem. But when they're this bad, no, it's not even worth it. Now I did, however, find this Dooney canvas with leather, beautiful, huge, huge tote, love it. I had to make this mine, well, for eBay. So if you're interested in that, you can find that on eBay, my eBay, eBay store. Keep going. I don't need another precious moment. No, no, just keep going. Like I need a hole in the head. So much to see. Brooches. Old Pepsi. These, those two were looking at me like, what is she doing? There's some jewelry. I love anything with hearts. And this necklace was gorgeous, like handmade and real gemstone. Beautiful. Anything with hearts, I love. And that was just gorgeous. probably need to go back and get that but of course it'd probably be gone you know how that goes earrings oh Jean jacket, so much china, oh, beautiful. Okay guys, we're back at my house. Uh, kind of show you, uh, not too many bags, but a few. Of course this Dooney, beautiful Dooney bag, canvas and leather, huge, love it. Awesome. If I don't sell that, I'm keeping that. Suede on the bottom. Oh, beautiful. Never actually seen one like that. And we got the Brighton, cute little Brighton bag. Leather, zip top. Heart on the bottom. I love hearts. So nice. Nice and clean inside. Beautiful. And another Brighton. It's like a metallic grayish green. It's so weird. It's beautiful though. Metallic green, I guess. It looks more gray in the video, but so nice. Nice and clean inside. Yellow. Like a honeycomb inside. Nice. canvas the front. Bye guys. Thanks for watching.